professional experience and yes kind of internship experience as well as education in total the person is applicable to make cv not resume resume itself says it's the thing that you are resuming something right resume means if for example i have been like working out here i have resumed my work but then i am switching to different work then i have resumed for some certain period maybe 5 uh, five days 10 days or maybe one month itself so here i have stopped my work and then again i am going to resume my work that is called resume means resume is applicable for the experienced person which is at the most important to understand and to make like to make a proper cv you should know what i am and how i can apply right so a prepared thing is cv and resume If you can see that in CV you have to write your academic qualification, research job in the sense while doing any kind of internship or publication. For example, many people like uh, research or for like do the publication some articles. For example, some blog writers may like are like do the articles, but they have done the publication, they have done the research. So you can go ahead with the research part as well because it's something important that extra you are showing to your career. Like showcase whatever you have ever done. Exact, always exact. The most important thing is never lie. The point you have mentioned, anything you have not done, is the only way to get rejected in every. I can say, assure you, in every interview. Because you never know what interviewer is going to ask you and how they can pick you up with any kind of question from your CV itself. So be genuine and be true to yourself. Objective is there. It should be specific of what you actually want. A simple, a straightforward goal, rather than writing a paragraph. Just a simple object. Obviously, objective has to change. You know, but कुछ तो चाहिए उसको दिखाने के लिए. So a simple and a straightforward object. That's it. Clear? Next, coming to resume. This is something that a person is. जो जिस जॉब रोल के लिए जा रहे हैं 
आपको तो पता होगा कि वो जो आपके हिसाब से कितना आप सुटेबल हो उस चीज के लिए तो आपको वो चीज मेंशन करना है कि मेरे पास ये स्किल सेट है मैं आपको इस इस वे से हेल्प कर सकता हूँ अगर आपने पहले तो प्राइवेट इंटर्नशिप किया हो जिसमें वो चीज़ आपने काम किया है आप हो सकते हो कि मुझे आपको सिखाना नहीं पड़ेगा मैं ऑलरेडी ये सब जानता हूँ आप मुझे बस थोड़ा सा गाइडेंस दे दोगे तो मैं ये चीज़ कर सकता हूँ Okay. It's not possible every time that I compose, dear Varsha, like uh, readings of the day, this and that. Okay. Sometimes like we can like use something like small abbreviation like that is P A P. What is P A P? Anyone? Please sign the attachment. Okay. Generally, like when we are sharing a meal, we don't use the shortcuts like suppose for the message we don't type like generally full message but we type msg right like different person uses different but in mail we don't use the shortcuts apart from few things like your we can't put you are but this like please find the attachment for the for your information that's it for you Okay. So this kind of thing we can use. Okay. But apart from that, like we don't use much of the like, shortcut which we use in the message. Okay. And uh, also like we don't use emojis to show our emotions. <laughs> Do you know why this happens in a mail and while we are sharing, like while while we are texting somebody in a WhatsApp or other kind of messages, we use a U R G R eight. This is and why we are not using this in a email any like any idea yeah formal and apart from that we consider mail as a professional platform of communication so that is the reason why we are not putting all those shortcuts which we are doing regularly on our uh, whatsapp and other texts right so this is the basic information as well as the difference yes ma'am Conscious about the words you use. 